Hello world, my crackets! Today we will look at the HTT 10 sensor. Moreover, its version on a printed circuit board immediately with auxiliary parts. The board has four contacts. They are signed. The sensor itself is located on the outside. It has a smooth body with an opening for air access. There is also an analog power converter, filtering capacitors and high to c bus pull-up resistors. The sensor can have one of two hardware addresses. To do this, you can solder a special address resistor. To connect to the microcontroller, two lines are enough, not counting the power supply, where I2C bus is used here. And so we connect and see what it shows. To do this, we connect the sensor with a 3.3 volt power supply and I2C bus number 1 of a microcontroller. We get such readings. Let's try a primitive test, namely you can touch the sensor body. In this case the temperature rises rather slowly, in contrast to humidity. This is due to the inertia of the housing and the fact that the sensing element is inside. At the same time the humidity changes faster, since the molecules of moist air very quickly reach the sensor. After releasing the finger, the situation is similar. Temperature drops more slowly than humidity. Consider the electrical circuit. An AHT10 sensor with a certain strapping of elements was used as a sensitivity element. Its signals are transmitted via the I2C bus to the STM32 microcontroller. Where they are processed and sent via the SPI bus to the ST7735 color display. Let's consider the software part. Include the necessary header files. Setting up the periphery. We set up two objects. Within an object for working with a display and an object for working with a sensor. It is necessary to specify the working interface in it. This is E2C number 1 the hardware address of a sensor. After calling two functions, initialization and start of measurements, we get the value of temperature and humidity. Additionally, it is organized in an endless loop. After the measurement, we give the value to the display with a delay between iteration of one second. The global sensor object contains the following values interface, address, Measure temperature and humidity values. Depending on the selected I2C interface, we configure the microcontroller pins as an alternative open drain. We configure the periphery of the E2C interface, address 7 bits, confirmation used, maximum speed, control via DMA, setting up DMA channels. We indicate the I2C data register we receive or transmit buffer, its size in bytes, sizes of memory and peripherals 8 bits. The procedures for reading data from the I2C bus are based on examples from STM. In this case, the part where the work with DMA is being used is used. We adjust the size of the data for reading. We generate a start signal. In the loop, we expect the start signal to be received. We generate the address of a sensor. In the loop, we wait for the address signal to be received. Then, through the DMA, we get useful data. After that, we generate a stop signal. In the cycle, we wait for the stop signal to be received. Now we copy the read data. The recording procedure is similar. First, copy from the local buffer to the global. We generate a start signal. In the loop, we are waiting for the start signal to be received. We generate the address of the sensor. In the loop, we wait for the address signal to be received. Next, we transfer the payload via DMA. After that, we generate a stop signal. In the cycle, we wait for the stop signal to be received. In the initialization procedure, we send a software reset signal to the sensor. 
In the measurement procedure we send 3 bytes of a measurement command to a sensor, waiting for 75 milliseconds and reading 6 bytes of data. Where 0 byte is skipped, it does not contain any payload. The next 5 bytes or 40 bits are 20 bits for humidity and 20 bits for temperature. We extract 20 bits each and convert their values from an unsigned number to a floating point number. We copy these values to the fields of a global object. That's all, see you in the next video. Subscribe my ticket.